spaces become places as they become imbued with the meaning through lived experience. The space that is produced, transformed, giving meaning and gaining an identity also gives an identity to the person who produces it. Within the scope of the Women in Space project, we aim to see what women can achieve or fail against gender inequality and stratification in our country, as in the rest of the world. Through this space, they produce, transform and give meaning and identity. In the first phase of the Women in Space project, we would like to give the microphone to the woman who created the space we met in the IBLP network. Welcome, Louisa. Could you please tell us a little bit about yourself and also your work? Well, uh, my name is Luisa Fernanda and I was born in Mexico in a nor northern state, which is name is Chihuahua. Uh, maybe you have heard about uh, the Copper Canyon. Well, it is located in Chihuahua and I'm the CEO and founder of Cinibi Hippe, uh, which is a socially responsible company that fosters the development welfare of indigenous family women, uh, their families and the preservation of their traditional culture expressions by offering handmade articles of clothing to the public. Uh, that's how we are able to achieve these goals. Luisa, how did you transform the place into a space? Well, I think that the best example I can give is about our sewing workshop where all the magic happens. Uh, at the beginning, it was just a dark room with four walls and with a little paint and uh, no decoration at all. And then we had to work on it and to transform it into a beautiful place that later became a refugee for many women who come to work. And I believe that places are not made by buildings or decoration. Places are made by people. This workshop is what it is because of the beautiful women who are there every single day. Luisa, how beautifully you explain places made by people. Yes. And the, uh, the another question is, how did you transform your identity through the space? I think this project has become part of me and it has changed my way of looking at life. I have tried to be consistent with the principles and values of my project and this has made me change the way I live. I have become a reference uh, regarding to social development projects, especially those that uh, have to do with indigenous uh, people in my country. Yes, and if the work we do becomes a part of us, how much love and passion is there? I see this in many different initiatives and very nice to hear from you too. And how about the disappointment or satisfaction part in the process? For Cinebi Hippe, my actual uh, company, I had other entrepreneurial projects in which I was dedicated to selling products that did not benefit anyone and they did not generate any social impact and those projects only filled my pocket with money but that only cost me an emptiness. So I promised myself to create a project that will add some value to people's life. How motivating is to hear these things, producing value in whatever we do. Sharing the value we produce is priceless, really. And my last question is, uh, what was your North Star in the process? 
Well, I have had several mentors uh, since I was very young. I have always said that I am an old soul and I have developed a friendship with people older than me, like 10 or 15 years older. And that has helped me a lot uh, since their advices have saved me uh, a couple of mistakes. I would like to add uh, something to this last question. Uh, there is a quote that says, you are the result of the people you surround yourself with. And I think it's very true and we have to choose very well our friendships. And that will help you a lot to develop yourself. I also believe that we are the result of the people we surrounded and thanks to be around us and thank you very much all for your sharing and very heartfelt talks. Thank you, Luis.